Hey guys, oh my god, I haven't filmed a video in a crazy minute, and I'm gonna explain everything. Don't you guys worry. I hope you guys don't leave me. I know a lot of people were like, where are you? She's here. This guy's amazing. Here. Uh, there were a lot of people saying that I was in the hospital and some crazy business like that. Never happened. Your girl was never in the hospital, so it's okay. You can calm down. So, at first, I wasn't gonna upload for just a couple days. I was just, you know, he makes YouTube videos. I had nothing that I really wanted to talk about after the last video that I uploaded. And then all of a sudden, Becky gets really sick with a stomach virus. This is TMI, but she was puking and just like super sick. And some other vloggers. Unbelievable. Congratulations on all of your success and and your YouTube channel. Watch one of your videos. And after you stir that, you're gonna wanna add your chicken broth, tomato juice, a little bit of tomato sauce, your vlogs are great. You know what? Okay, cool. Peter, you see this guy? Yeah. They're unbelievable. Incredible. Whenever he's done with his grand slam, I'm thinking maybe we should connect with him and the three of us should do a collab. Oh, that sounds like a fantastic idea. When are we doing it? When's it happening? I don't know. So I'm just going to make this video and he's going to see this video and then. And then he'll, he'll contact. Probably you or me on, I don't know, somewhere. And then we'll make a collab together. But you're down? I'm, yeah, 100% down. Okay. Uh, okay. I'm yeah. amazed. I'm going to get back to my YouTube video. I'm, thanks, Peter. Okay, see ya. I love what you do. I love your message. There has just been so many people who have been sick lately, and you're just, like, bound to get it if you're around someone who has it. The channel is linked below. If you're seeing this video and you're interested in this extraordinary athlete, also, YouTuber, please go subscribe. Send him some love. Congrats, man. This is uh, this is amazing. If you guys hear a really loud noise, it is so windy outside. It's like crazy. Where are the Amberlynn Reed videos? Stopped making Amberlynn Reed videos? Must be nice. Look, I would make... Hi, it's Willow Davis, by the way. I would make more reaction videos if, as I've said before, if... If there was anything like that was interesting to watch, there's no more Walmart trips or Lexington or anything like, like what am I? She, G Fuel not sponsored. Delicious though. I should do a review. Anyway, there's nothing. There's nothing interesting to watch. You know, I can't even watch the videos. How am I supposed to react to them if I can barely sit there and watch them? No offense. So how's your weekend going? I had some thing done. Ooh, ooh, I'm not supposed to bend that way. I, that's quite a lift. That's a higher lift than I thought it would be. This thing, ow. Whew, gotta stretch before I do this. I had this thing done to my foot. Oh, it's all whited out from the light though. It's all bandaged up. I get to take this off in a couple hours. Whew. Problem with my nail, it's all good now, probably. I guess we'll find out when I take it off. Uh, I'm not worried about it. Anyway, so here I am, this is my weekend. I'm chilling at home, not leaving for very many things. I could walk on it a little bit. It's probably, I'm being dramatic, it's, it's fine, everything's fine. I don't know, I'll flick through, we'll see, we'll see what, what, what the, the lady has been up to. Let me prop myself up here, get, get this elevated, you know. So I did this thing on Instagram a few months ago where I asked people to send me assumptions about me. But all of a sudden I go on YouTube two days in a row and everyone and their mama and their uncle and their grandpa are doing these assumed things about me. That's true, my grandpa had some very assumptive things to say about you, Amberlynn Reed, let me tell you. Let's spill some tea. I have seen some of the assumptions you guys have made about me and it's just like, Y'all don't play. Like, you guys are literally haters. And 
very, very badly because there are some things on here that I'm just like, do I want to admit to this? All right, let's get on into these assumptions already. Your dog has a tumor. Um, that assumption is incorrect. Well, that's a relief. Been worried this whole time. Thanks for clearing that up. This is a huge, a huge assumption. And the assumption is Becky has to help you to wipe. I can tell you right now, if that was the case, I, I just wouldn't be in a relationship. Well, then who would wipe? Sad about people hating on you, but strong enough to push through. I'm gonna say that's a true assumption. It is sad. It's sad that our society is to that point where people are just horrible. I feel like- Interesting that you're blaming all of society for this. I think I got this at the Bronx Zoo. When I was a little kid, I wouldn't go to the zoo now. Don't support the zoo. This little guy though, he's staying. I rescued him. Not really, I don't like, I don't like people misusing the term rescue for animals. This is a stuffed animal though. Not literally stuffed. Well, it is stuffed, not literally an animal. There's no validating the hate that I receive. Um, sometimes maybe. Other times, I don't know, seems pretty legit. Just because there's some ridiculous ones doesn't mean the other ones aren't good. I feel like there's a big portion of people who just couldn't withstand some of the things that people say about me. Now that's actually true. I think there's a lot of people who just wouldn't be able to take all this. However, you can't say, I, she must know that she incites it, right? It's like, you could, if, if you ignore it enough, like, like just all like the, th the ridiculous things, instead of like mentioning them in videos and just like keeping it rolling and having those kind of snowball into bigger things and spreading the f false message to more people. It's like, it's, I mean, it is a good way to get views, I guess, even though you're having people hate you like there would be less hate if you talked about the ridiculous comments that you get probably or you know laughed them off a little more I don't know it's like I'm sure if I if I made public statements in videos about every like uh, negative comment I get about like veganism or something then it would just it would build up, you know, people would be like, oh, this guy gets triggered by the comments, let's just keep, let's see what he does if I say this, you know, it's like, you, 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 you know that it's just gonna make it worse, but it is getting you more views, and like, that's like your whole shtick, you know, that's, that's like the whole thing, don't you shtick in every video, I must have used it like almost every video that I've posted to YouTube so far, what a word, so I, yeah, I don't, I can't really, uh, this, this video and the most recent one that was uploaded like yesterday, it was, it's like half an hour long and I, I flicked through and the entire thing is one scene and I just can't, I can't do it. So, as I said before, you know, like I will, I, I would love to do some of these reactions, I, maybe I'll find some other people or something, I don't know, but... I can't like force more than just like these little clips out of these videos, you know. And it's, it's, I'm, I don't mind it at all. I like making other stuff. Maybe some some people only like the Emily Reed stuff, and, and that's fine. But you know, it's just like I'll do, I'll do whatever comes along, whatever inspires me. Look at my hands. Could do some shadow puppets. Oh, uh, now I'm too too uh, unfocused. Okay. Okay, so I guess that'll do it. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves. And got the Riff Raff Cup. Had good flavors as a starter pack. No one cares. We'll talk about it later, actually. Maybe I'll stream a game tonight. Okay, this isn't, this isn't a live stream. I should stop just mumbling and get on 
into editing this video. So thanks for hanging out. Hope you, hope you enjoyed that little Casey Neistat thing. Gonna keep rambling. People have been saying like, oh, I'll just react to some of like the Destiny era stuff forever. I might, I'll, I'll, I'll browse around. It's, I'm not concerned about it or anything, you know? When it, if, if the inspiration comes, it'll come, am I right? All right, so I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Um, you, you, you're subscribed, right? But did you ding the bell? I get a lot of random comments, people saying like, oh weird, I wasn't notified about this video. I didn't get a notification, nothing popped up on my phone. Just make sure you hit that bell. Cause I, I feel weird. Like if someone says like, hey, I, I mean, I know YouTube's like having weird issues and stuff. I'm sure there's actual people who are subscribed to things with the bell and they're not getting notifications every once in a while for whatever reason. Maybe YouTube's trying out some new beta thing, who knows, but if you want to get all the notifications for my videos, make sure you ding that bell next to where you subscribed, am I right? To just take a look, you know, think about it. Enough of that. See you next time. Willow Davis, out. Perfect. Perfect.